right, say you are behind an electric drum kit and you can't reach Blender. We have a Blender app that you can just open up. What you're gonna do is hit the Bluetooth button on Blender. It's gonna send out a pairing signal and you can connect to Blender. Once one person has connected to the app, multiple people can connect. They just need to hit the uh, join a network option uh, after the initial person has connected. So we're gonna go ahead and connect to Blender. It's going to pair. And voila, we have your individual monitor mix right on your phone. That is slick. So there are six different channels for the six different inputs that we have on Blender. And you can actually tap the one and I can go ahead and assign vocals on there because I'm singing and I've got a guitar. Oh, you can give it a name. Yeah, you can put yeah, a yeah. little icon on there. Okay. So Tom's number four. Uh, we can give him the guitar. Yep. And we've got five. We've got a drum machine. So I'm going to put um, the drum icon on there. Okay. And that way I can just quickly reference and remember which one's which. I don't have to think about which number and which input people are into. But it essentially works the same way. You can just hit your headphone and adjust the levels. You can also hit Tom's headphones. Don't right you now. mess with my headphones. You can mess with mix. his levels <laughs> at all as well. So if you want to mess with someone else in the band, yeah. you can you can do that too. Yeah. Um, another great feature is you can also hit uh, the talk button and activate that as well. We'll talk about the talk button a little bit more later. Uh, and you also have access to the uh, mute, mute all. You can hit your compression and um, you've also got your, yeah, your room mic or the talk mic as well. So that's Blender app. Cool. Definitely it's free download from your uh, iOS or Android app store. Very useful.